All right, we are here live in front of the Ford Center, uh, the opening this week. Uh, my man here, Trey Williams, uh, going to get to compete with some of the best players in the country this week and also get to compete with some of his future teammates. First off, what's it like to be here at the opening and playing against the best players in the country? It's a great honor. I mean, it's something you dream about when you're really little. You see the YouTube videos or the D-line, O-line, one-on-ones. It's just it's a dream come true for real. So I'm blessed to be here. What's it like to be here with the, uh, you know, you guys have a historic defensive line class coming in and, you know, four of you guys are here. I know Miles isn't going to be able to uh, participate this week, but having all four of you guys out here together. It's, it's great. It's uh, definitely something that's probably never happened before. Uh, Cause our whole D line class is here, and that that has to be some type of record. I'm not sure. We could check later, but it's, I'm pretty sure it's unprecedented, and I'm glad to be a part of it. What's it gonna be like to go against some of your future teammates on the other side of the ball this week? You looking forward against going to, against Paul and Mitchell and Walker? Yeah, it's a, it's gonna be a very it's gonna be a very quick snapshot uh, the three to four years to, to come. So yes, sir, I'm excited. All right, obviously you've been committed to Clemson for a while. You guys are having this great class. You know, what's it like for you to be part of such a special class? It's really, it's really an honor and a blessing. I mean, it doesn't happen to everybody every day. And so I just try to take it, as much, take it all in at one time, keep working, and make this class even greater when what we get of, there. What kind of bond are you guys building? And this week, obviously, you'll be able to build those bonds even tighter. Mm. We are incredibly close. We talk almost every day, all of us, DJ, everybody, DeMarcus, all of us, Fred Davis, everybody. So we, we're pretty close. A couple guys out here this week you guys will be recruiting. What kind of pitch are you going to give those guys to, to join the Clemson family? Nobody likes losing. <laughs> That's great. And dogs want to play with dogs. So, I mean, if you want to come play with some dogs, you want, you want to win, the champi win championships, come to Clemson. All right, we were talking before we started the interview about your relationship you've built with Brian and how close you guys are getting. Talk a little bit about that. Man, me and Brian are very, very close. Uh, I've known him since freshman year now, and we're just getting closer and closer because I know before we both committed to Clemson, a lot of schools were trying to recruit us together as a pair before that anyway. Mm -hmm. It just so happened that the, end of, the spot we ended up landing was Clemson. All right, what do you want to get out of this week? Um, Just a... Just to fine tune my skills for the season. I'm trying to have a big senior season. I'm trying to help with my t uh, have my team win a national championship. All right, last question for you, and that was a great lead in. When you guys all get to Clemson, how many national championships does the Tiger fans have to look forward to from y'all's historic class? Man, if we work, it could be three. It could be oh, this Brian right there. But if, I mean, if we put the work in, I don't see why we can't just keep winning them until we leave. We're going to lead a jersey better than we found it. So. All right, Trey, thank you so much for taking time to join us here, and uh, we'll be here all week to cover you. I oh, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you.